think that maybe it's because of the uh, the marketing. I think when you go into a corner store or you go into anywhere and you see Newport postings or you see anywhere dealing with like menthol cigarettes, um, you see like a black person. You see the black couple, you see a black man, a black girl holding the cigarette. And I guess like black people ain't gonna say we easily, well I am, I'm gonna say we easily influenced. And if one, one person, if one person doing it, we all fall suit and we all do the same thing. So I ain't gonna say we cause not me. But 88%, I feel like it's just more so marketing and also society. I feel like those 88% who don't know the education, who don't know the harms behind menthol, um, and started smoking at an early age, probably was their first cigarette, you know, menthol got that little taste that make it not taste so bad, so they probably feel like that they don't have a, a very harsh cigarette, so they turn to menthol. So I feel like it's more so the flavoring, got a little bit to do with society and a lot to do with marketing. Well, um, a regular cigarette is just the regular tobacco. With a menthol cigarette, it has like a mint flavor into it, so it actually cools the throat and supposed to make the cigarette taste better. Okay. So I'm thinking though, maybe those 88% of those African Americans like that, like that taste. I guess they, they probably think they smoking a better cigarette or something, I don't know. But I think so, it's more so the taste.